Hello, friends! Today I am going to be doing an unboxing.、Um, Yumi Twins reached out to me and they asked if I wanted to receive one of their boxes and do a review on it. And of course, I had to say yes. I Really, really have been wanting to go to Japan for a really long time.、Um, and I've been seeing so many people on my Instagram going, and it makes me sad because I want to go. And I feel like getting a Japanese subscription box is the closest I'm going to get at this point. So, very excited to open this up.、Um, I haven't opened it yet, so this will be a total surprise.、Um, I've got my box cutter ready here. So, Full disclosure,、um, I was sent this for free,、uh, but they are not paying me to say anything or anything like that. Kawaii monthly box from Japan with love. So sweet. Also, how cute is this box? Also, can we just talk about how cute this box is?、Um, yeah.、Uh, oh my god! <gasps> oh my gosh. I'm already dying. I, as some of you know, I'm sure, I love Halloween. I love October. We are into holiday season right now, and I'm not particularly fond of the holidays just because I've been working retail for so long.、Um, so, oh my gosh, getting a Halloween box is perfect. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. Oh my god, oh, it's like a catalog of all the stuff that's in here. I'm not gonna look at it too closely because I wanna look at, it at the actual things, but I haven't watched this yet. People really love this show. Agretzko? Agretz? What's her name again? Anyway, you know. Okay. Oh my god. Oh, everything is so cute.、Oh, so satisfying. What is it? Oh, I think it's a keychain. I mean, I guess I can refer to my handy little book that I got here. Oh my god. Should I, I should open it, right? That's, that's the whole point of this video. It's so satisfying to squish. Also, I just realized I lost the chain. There we go. What is this? A huge keychain. <laughs> If that's what it's meant to be. Oh my gosh. I mean, this will probably just sit on a shelf somewhere. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. Okay, let's put this over here. Also, packaging. I love cute packaging. Definitely a sucker for that. Oh my gosh. <gasps> It's a little comb. Yes. Oh my gosh. Yes. Amazing. I just, I love the Halloween vibes. So good. And it's glittery. This is actually like really handy though. Good for traveling for the day that I actually get to go to Japan. <laughs> oh my gosh. What's this? I think it's a mirror. Everything is glittery. I love it. Oh, yeah, it is. Oh, that's perfect. So cute. Again, perfect for traveling. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. How cute. Oh, it's like. Oh, it's Dios de los Muertos. Oh, that's so cute. Also, I'm sorry, I probably said that, butchered that so poorly. But you know what I mean. Day of the Dead. That is super cute. I love that. I don't know why, but I just. This is so cute, this little avocado motif with the little avocado cubes.
This is actually such a good size for markers and stuff. I feel like, let me just, let's test this out. Yes, oh my God, yeah, perfect. For makeup and or art supplies on the go. What is this? Last thing. Ooh. Oh my gosh. Look at them. They're so cute. This is me. Take yourself. This is me. What? Oh, is it? Oh, it's like a lamp. So I think the light shines out from the top and then you put the batteries in the bottom. Oh my gosh, look at how cute they are. Look at this little snail. Oh my gosh, the snail has a pumpkin for a shell. <laughs> I love how apathetic they look. <laughs> oh my gosh. These characters are so cute. Look at these little blobs. I don't know what they are, but they're so cute. Okay, that was super fun. I've never gotten a subscription box before, so I'm very excited to have gotten one from Japan. I am so happy that it was a holiday box. Look at this, look at this print inside this box too. So cute. I might have to keep this and just use it for storage. I also went ahead and put batteries into the lamp to see what it looked like and you can see the character is illuminated in different changing colors and it's super super cute. So now that we've seen all of the items, I thought it would be fun to create an illustration that is inspired by this Yumi box. All right, so I apologize that we've skipped ahead here. I think my phone had run out of memory space and so it didn't record the beginning stages of this painting. So I do apologize for that. But anyways, on to this illustration. So since the dominant color in the selection of items was purple, I decided to do the same for this painting. I also wanted to go for a limited color palette, so I chose to have yellow be the secondary color to complement the purple. Then as a fun nod, I gave the girl in my portrait a set of earrings of the Sanrio characters featured in this box, uh, who were My Melody and Kuromi. I have really been into berets and stamen earrings lately, so this was the perfect opportunity to indulge in that. For this painting, I used my new Paul Rubens watercolor set on 140 pound cold press watercolor paper by Fabriano. Before this video, I actually filmed my review video on this Paul Rubens set, so I'll be editing and uploading that video next very, very soon. And other than that, I don't really have much else to say about the painting, so I'll let you guys watch and I'll be back to give my final thoughts on the Yumi Twins box.
So, as I stated at the beginning of the video, before getting this box, I had actually never received or paid for a subscription box before. And while my reactions to the items are all genuine, I don't think I would ever personally pay for a subscription box like this yearly. Mostly because I feel like that's a large accumulation of knickknacks that I wouldn't know what to do with after the sixth or seventh box, I feel like. However, I do think that grabbing one or two boxes here and there would make for a really nice Japanese themed treat to yourself or would make a really great gift for somebody else. It's like getting a little taste of Japan when you're unable to go there yourself. So if you're interested in grabbing a box for you or a friend, feel free to check out the description box below for a direct link. Treat yourself, you deserve it. Anyways, thank you so much for watching. Like and subscribe to see what else I'm gonna be up to this coming year. I'm hoping to make way more YouTube videos coming 2020, so stay tuned for that. Anyway, looking forward to seeing you next time. Bye.